Hello everybody and welcome to what I eat in a day while I am pregnant in my third trimester. Today's video is actually sponsored by HelloFresh, so thank you HelloFresh for sponsoring this video and later in this video we will be making a HelloFresh meal together. So I usually start off the morning by making a pot of coffee. I do drink caffeine while I'm pregnant. I just try to keep it to a little amount, especially since I don't really like how a lot of caffeine makes me feel anyway. I try to keep it to about one to two cups per day. And then if I want more coffee, I'll switch to decaf. When I see your face, I can stop myself from spiraling. If you are new to our channel, we'd love to have you come and hang out with us. So please subscribe. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. And go and follow us over on Instagram. Along with my coffee, I always make sure that I have a glass of water as well. When I make a cup of water in the morning, I tend to drink water throughout the entire day. But if I don't right in the morning have a glass of water, I feel like I never get enough in my body. And when I'm pregnant, I need to drink a lot of fluids. I also take the opportunity to grab my prenatal vitamins as well because if I don't take them in the morning, then I completely forget. Those of you who have been a part of our channel for a while will realize that I recently switched over to a different prenatal vitamin. This company is called Ritual and I'll actually talk about them in my upcoming pregnancy update. To figure out what you left. I know that I have done some things I do regret and I don't blame you for leaving I might have done the same Along with this prenatal vitamin that actually includes DHA in it, I also take a probiotic as well. By this point the coffee's pretty much brewed and I put one Splenda in my coffee along with whole milk. My husband's a milkman so we get our milk really fresh. You all are probably wondering why I'm putting whipped cream on my coffee but it's actually really delicious. I'll put whipped cream and then I will also put some cinnamon as well. Yeah my heart belongs to you cause I'm not old. Where my daughter is little but boy is she mighty <laughs> and usually we spend every morning having a dance party <laughs> I swear it looks like I'm the only one having a dance party right now but my kids do eventually come <laughs> and join me after I drink some coffee I start on my breakfast now I tend to eat a low carb diet um, I do dabble in between like a ketogenic diet and low carb I really like this Ezekiel bread it's low in carbs it's flourless and it's just like a really good portal for the fatty cream cheese that my body has been craving this pregnancy I'm not really a cream cheese kind of person but for some reason this baby just wants cream cheese so what I actually like to do is go to a local bagel shop and I get the cream cheese from there because it's just the best So I have two pieces of the Ezekiel toast and then I will do one with the scallion cream cheese and then one with the jalapeno cream cheese for no other reason besides I can't make up my mind and my body craves both so I just have one of each. All the fun we used to have. In the morning is when I sit down and I answer any emails, I answer some comments on YouTube, check over Instagram or whatnot. Um, but as usual, here is my daughter. <laughs> she is so hilarious. It's an ongoing joke on our channel that my daughter steals all of my food, which she always does, which is perfectly fine, but I should just know better. So here I am just grabbing a plate for her. Wanna drown into your eyes and feel your blue sky
So while we were sitting there, she actually ended up asking me for more toast, which I was kind of hungry as well, and I technically only got to eat like one and one fourth pieces of my breakfast. So I made her an extra piece of the scallion, and then I made myself another jalapeno slice. Normally I would try not to eat like two and a half pieces of this bread in the morning, but my body wasn't craving the bread itself, it was actually craving the cream cheese. And if you think about it, with the amount of water that I had already drank this morning, if my body was just craving cream cheese and my baby right now is in the stage where it's gaining fat, it's just basically the baby is just getting fatter and fatter. If really what I'm craving is fat content in my diet, I'm completely content with giving my body what it's asking for. So I ended up having another piece of toast with my daughter while she ate hers. All the waterfalls and the wild waters Hanging off the cliffs, counting all the shadows And now we're in the shadows I wanna feel your blue And then like you'll see many times in this video, it's time for more water. Now later that day for lunch, we decided to have one of our HelloFresh meals. We really enjoy getting HelloFresh because it's a meal kit that makes cooking super simple. It's basically broken down into six steps per meal. We get three meals at a time, and today we decided that we are going to make hamburgers. Personally, just do not like cooking, but when I cook HelloFresh, it's simple enough for me to do. All the ingredients are there for you, pre-packaged in small portions, making it super simple. You basically never have to reach for a measuring cup, which is fine by me. Where to start? I need someone to empty this heart. We've tried a few other meal kit services and we always end up coming back to HelloFresh. I think it's just because the produce is always the freshest and because there's so many different options when it comes to meals. We always find ourselves missing it. We also find that it saves us money because I don't know if you've ever tried to make a new recipe before that has multiple ingredients in it. Not only does it cost a lot because you're buying the full size of those ingredients, but it also just clogs up our refrigerator and we end up just throwing away majority of the stuff. So it's nice to be able to try out recipes before actually committing to all of those ingredients. It's everything changes and so must we just stay true to what you believe in when the nightingale sings you should spread your wings take off and start If you guys would like to give HelloFresh a try, you can, and you can get $80 off, including free shipping on your first box. There are additional restrictions that do apply, so go to HelloFresh.com for more details. And when you guys do go to get your first box, see if they have this meal available because it was so delicious. So don't forget to head down below, click on the link, and use the code that you see on your screen to get $80 off, including free shipping on your first box.
eating lunch around 12.45 and as you guys saw, I didn't eat any of the bread and I had only about half the french fries so I was definitely hungry by the time that 3.30 rolled around. So I decided to have a Granny Smith apple with my favorite organic peanut butter from Trader Joe's and I also had the uh, everything bagel seasoning on top of that as well. This is like one of my absolute favorite, favorite snacks to have. It's so delicious. Coffee down the street, the place we always used to meet. It's getting cold here in LA. I know it's only been two weeks. I can't eat, I'm losing sleep, I'm missing you on Sunday. I will make and just like that, I needed more water in my cup. This is probably like the seventh or eighth time that I filled up my Yeti. And truthfully, the majority of the day is spent doing the exact same thing. I really don't know how much water I actually drink while I'm pregnant, but I've noticed that when I stay on top of it, I feel so much thinner and my skin isn't as itchy. My hair feels better, my nails feel better. Everything about my body just feels better while I'm pregnant when I drink enough water. And then a few hours later, dinner rolled around. It was actually a really busy day for Dan and I, so we decided instead of cooking that we would order out. I got a large garden salad with grilled chicken and some fresh mozzarella on top of it. And then we also split a chili as well. But that concludes what I eat while I'm pregnant uh, in the third trimester. Some days I eat less, some days I eat more, but I try to just eat intuitively. If you really like this video, please do not hesitate to give it a thumbs up. It really helps support our channel. And come and subscribe and hang out with us while we welcome our third baby. See you soon. Say